Uh, all right, so so uh, let me uh, give give you the rundown. So I have to do a story of self, right? Mm. Story of self, and like I feel like I've told the story of myself like already like enough, you know. So instead of uh, saying it, and doing it again, I just thought like I'd let you guys tell it. So um, you can just go from uh, from the top. I think like really. Like, like your life story? Like, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you really have to start with conception. <laughs> yeah, you gotta start I there. I was gonna say, you know, his middle name is named after the island where he was conceived. I feel like that's an important fact that we should know. Lorenzo. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Um, so. Nathan Lorenzo Fervoy. Fervoy was born. Um, a Taurus. A Taurus. Stubborn. Uh-huh. I suppose in Illinois. I don't know. Yeah. Yep. Illinois. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Um. What up, homeboy? What up? What up? What's good, man? You made it. Yes, we did. Yeah. Uh, just from the top, you know. Just uh. Anything you want to say? To you, like, really, just like go. Like now, like start. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Goofy shit about Nathan. Uh, uh, well, he was conceived <laughs> on Lavonzo Island. Na- Nathan Lavonzo for a boy. Mm. Uh, we used to chill at your house, hella. Yeah, basement. And your parents, they're cool. One of them uh, sings uh, yeah, opera. I was, I was about to say. The that. other one is a graphic designer. Yeah, they. His house is constantly filled with NPR, which is why he does what he does, which is why we're here right now. Great, great radio. Uh, <laughs> raised on that shit. Um, shout out Terry Gross. Big shout out Terry yeah. Gross. Um, eldest. Eldest. Of, yeah. of three. Three. Yeah. Two, two brothers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. That's true. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And now enter Evanston. And now enter <laughs> Evanston into the story. Um, Evanston, downtown yeah. Evanston. You just walk around <laughs> down to it's not downtown. You, it's like four blocks with a movie theater and a Five Guys. You, you, Evanston is a, a suburb that is like right on the border of the first neighborhood in Chicago on the north side. But the it's a weird environment due to the fact that there's a college, a very prestigious college at one end. There's yeah. a little mini hood at one end. There's uh we there's only one high school so every every little fucking kid goes to that fucking high school and like so they're all from all over the fucking you know Evanston's and it's very many faces it's and a, facets. It's a real strange mix of like suburbs kids and like suburbs kids who think they're hood and like a couple kids who are hood and like but the, even the, the inter- kids but like the intermingling vibe of that just makes everybody just ridiculous all right that was a real weird ramble that was a real weird ramble yeah. let's be more focused evanston no, i that was that was pretty that was like pretty accurate i, I know it is but it's hard to not make it ramble you know it's like what is evanston like yeah you know and then he came to college and, oh wow yeah oh sorry did i skip too far no i don't know maybe okay. i don't think there's I don't know. Oh, he, was, the story he played along. music. Yeah. He was mm-hmm. kind of sad though. He like missed Evanston. Mm-hmm. He was like, "Where are my friends?" Mm-hmm. And then, but then enter us. us. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Here we are. Um, and then we all lived together sophomore year. Yeah. Um, in a house that was it's like six a seven people. Yeah. It was a party Como house. Yeah. It was, gr- it was gross. Yeah. It, but it was it was chaotic. Yeah. But it was it was manically fun at times. Uh huh manically like crazy kind of mm-hmm. formative formative learned learned mm-hmm. experience i think we all grew from that yep um he met i don't know how personal are we supposed to be here you know like <laughs> <laughs> i don't know um, he like he's like, happy right who, now you know and it's, yeah, i don't know life. like yeah but that's that's what you're out there doing like you're displaced from your people and you're out there like three years with new people and that shit's like you know you've got a bond with them so i don't know what that's like because i haven't done all that but like you know 
I don't know. I don't know what it is, but like when you're somewhere else and you come back to your hometown, or when you're in your hometown and you go somewhere else, you, you see like who your people are and who your friends are, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You left. I don't know, like you left, but like, yeah, that shit's different when you're here, you know? Like, Yep. I'll try and send you these videos. I don't know how the fuck I'll do it because they're long as hell, but Dropbox. When do you yeah. need them? Do you need them tonight? I'm sorry. Nice guy. Yeah. He's, yeah. And then what, anything, anything, life story? I don't know. He's just excited to see what comes next. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, yeah. Sweet, sweet. Yeah. Anything else that you think is important that we cover? No, that's, uh, that's pretty thorough. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Excellent. Yeah, um, thanks, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> really excited. Was that good?